President Trump on Wednesday blasted California Governor Gavin Newsom for halting executions for the state's 737 death row inmates. Defying voters, the governor of California will halt all death penalty executions of 737 stone-cold killers. Friends and families of the always forgotten victims are not thrilled, and neither am I. Trump tweeted early Wednesday. The tweet comes hours before Newsom, a Democrat, is expected to sign an executive order that would halt all executions at San Quentin State Prison, closing a new execution chamber. The order would also withdraw lethal injection regulations. The order, though, would leave all convictions intact. The intentional killing of another person is wrong. And as governor, I will not oversee the execution of any individual, Newsom said in a prepared statement obtained by the Southern California News Group. Newsom, who has been a vocal opponent of the death penalty, said that the system is a failure that is discriminated against defendants who are mentally ill, black and brown, or can't afford legal representation. He also said that many innocent people have been wrongly convicted and sometimes put to death. But Newsom's order will go against the wishes of California voters, who in 2016 backed a measure to speed up executions. The Association of Deputy District Attorneys blasted Newsom for usurping the will of the voters and substituting his personal preferences. But Newsom said that the death penalty is flawed because it is irreversible and irreparable in the event of human error and expensive, costing California $5 billion since 1978. Meanwhile, Trump has been a supporter of the death penalty. In October, Trump called for the death penalty for those who kill police officers, 